Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art, and let's draw another cool character from Kirby Star Allies, and this time it's gonna be Meta Knight. So let's get started with a quick sketch, and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this, and to begin, we're gonna draw his uh, mask first, which is gonna be. We're gonna draw one angle. Okay, so it's gonna be looking straight at us, and then on the side here, just come down. And now we're just going to connect it with the same angle as that one. So this is going to be the opening. Okay, so then in here, just draw one line on each side coming down. There's going to be some thickness to the mask. Okay, so now we're just going to follow the angle again. And then on the corner here, just draw two little lines. Okay, so now we're going to draw, let's see, the eyeball inside. So it's just going to be two U-shapes. And let me shade it in real quick so we can see the eye a little bit better. It's a pretty cool looking character. Okay, yeah, that looks better, right? Now it looks nice and mean. Okay, so now we're going to draw the circle around him. So this is a little bit tricky. Um, just start right around on the side here. Just try to draw as best as you can, just kind of round shape. And you can use any kind of drawing aid to help you if you want to. Okay. So we're just going to go there and then we're just going to draw a line right in the middle here. Okay. So now we're going to come up, and this is the tricky part. We're going to come up to the top of the circle. Just try to imagine the, the circle all the way around. And then now we're gonna go, just draw like a little arc. Okay, and then we're gonna give it one spike. And then we're gonna draw another one. Continuing the circle, and then we draw another spike here. And so on this side, one spike. And you can sketch in the circle first if you want, um, just to help you out. Okay, and then we're gonna draw another spike. Once we have the spike, then we're just going to draw in the detail inside. So we're going to go... Okay, so from the corners here, just point it into the center. Okay, so we have four diamond shapes. And then now all we have to do is just kind of connect the middle. Okay, so now we have a complete face and on his face mask. So now we're going to draw the body, which is, I guess, I guess you can say it's part of the head. So just slightly behind it. So we just got to draw like a little circle right behind the mask. Okay. doesn't have to be perfect just as long as there's something behind it. Okay. So now let's draw, let's see, we can draw the arm, but let's draw the foot because it's a little bit, uh, Kind of a bigger area to draw. So we're gonna come out a little bit and then well let's let's just make it easy. We'll just go all the way out and draw like a, kind of like an almond shape. Okay? And then from that we're gonna draw in this detail here so we just kind of go across and then in the middle we're gonna draw here. Just draw like a little line. Okay so on, the, on this side same thing as well. It's gonna be two almond shapes curve, then line to the tip, okay, because it's in perspective a little bit. Alright, so now let's draw in his uh, armor um, on his shoulder. So for this one, we can just draw, we can just, almost like a check mark, just like a little curve like that. And then we're going to give it some thickness, same curve. And then on the inside here, we're just going to make one bulge and just kind of curve it to the tip. Okay, and then I know there's some detail in here. Um, let's draw like a little M in there, right? So I'm just going to draw M and then give this some thickness here. It's a little bit harder to draw with a thick Sharpie. Okay, so I'll just leave it as that. And then for his hand, we're going to draw, let's see, he's got 
Again, we're gonna draw a little U shape here. And then we're gonna give this line some thickness here. Round it out. And then continue to round it out here. And then his thumb's gonna be sticking out just a little bit. And then we're gonna draw his hand here, just close it off. And then for his arm, we'll just kind of go all the way in, push up all the way pin. Okay? So let's draw the other side, and he's gonna be holding a sword. So from here, right around here, we're just gonna curve. That's gonna be his thumb. And then on the bottom here, we're just gonna curve it all the way around. So we're keeping it simple. And then he's gonna go to his body, his arm. We just draw one and two. Okay, so now we gotta draw the sword. So we're gonna come up a little bit, just draw two lines, just close it off. So it's gonna go this way. And then now right here, we're gonna draw the circle right above the little rectangle. And then now we're just gonna go out on each side. And then we're gonna come back in. And then now we're just gonna follow the curve of the circle. Okay, so that's one, so we're gonna, we're gonna keep going up. So we're gonna draw two lines, shorter. And then let's see, we're gonna go out. So we're gonna go out like this. And draw another corner. Okay, so that's another one. So we're gonna draw one more. So two st straight lines going out and have it be a little bit wider. Go out. Another corner. And then we gotta draw the very tip. So we're gonna, again, just go out a little bit and then just close it off to a point. And then we can draw the center line now. So from here, to from the center, we just draw all the way back down into the circle. So now we gotta draw the uh, little bit of the, the shoulder pad here. So we just draw one line, just curve it out and just curve and just come back in and then just kind of continue that line. And then maybe just a little bit of corner right there. So just to su suggest that there's a, you know, the sh same shoulder pad on the other side as well. All right, so now we're gonna draw his wings. So right here on top of his head, we're just gonna go out and then we're gonna draw like a little curve like that. Then we're gonna come out. Okay, so now, now we're gonna give it some thickness here. One, two. Okay, this one can be a little bit thinner. And then let's draw in this one here, a little claw. Okay, and then we're gonna draw one more in here. So we're gonna keep it simple. So one more, double line. And then now we're just gonna connect these two. So we're gonna go in and come back out. Same thing here, we're gonna go in and just come back out somewhere. Okay, so that's one. So on the other one, it's hidden behind the sword, but we still have to draw it. So we're gonna go out. Same thing. And let's have it go out and we can't see the rest. So now we're just gonna, let's give us these lines some thickness here. One, two. Okay, let's draw a little claw here. And then this one, we'll draw one somewhere down here. Now we can't really see it, but we can kind of imagine if it's somewhere down here, we'll probably curve up like this. Curve down to this one. And that is it for this Meta Knight from Kirby Star Allies. Hope you guys like the way it turned out. And if you do, please do give me a thumbs up and I will see you next time.